Cubics. Robots for everyone. It's a dream come true to anyone who has ever dreamed of having their very own robot pal. Yeah, hey, right, Techie. Just get on with the review already. See? Anyway, the opening thing to the show is actually pretty catchy. But anyway, meet Connor. He's your typical boy that loves robots with a passion. Huh? A Brutex? And a Detectix? Whoa! A Propelix! There's another one! There are a lot of ticks in this town, isn't there? Connor is moving to a town called Bubble Town. A town well known for their robots. We're gonna live in Bubble Town? They have as many robots as people! Excellent! Okay, okay! <laughs> these robots must be pretty darn cool then. Let's take a look at these robots in action. Beat your eyes! Wow, how about me? Sure! Smile party! No, that's a heck of a head! Green's your color, baby! Green! I'm sick of green! Anyone around here like the color green? Who don't like green? I don't! Oh! Yeah, yellow's good too, and uh, personally, I prefer purple! Holy scraps, lady! Uh, I thought this was a kid's show! She just straight up murdered his aft! Let's meet someone else. <laughs> this is Abby and her adorable little sidekick, Don Don. Everyone needs a Don Don. I mean, just look at it. So freaking cute. Abby, because she clearly has nothing better to do, has got her little robo pet to go spy on her new neighbor that happens to be Connor. <laughs> Don. After an awkward yelling, Abby decided it would be best to take Don Don to some workshop. I'm taking Don Don to the body's pit. Body's pit? You heard what I said. Make up that as you wish. There they meet Hella and stereotypes fat kid and nerdy kid. Really, that's all you really need to know. And then we meet the star. Are of the show. Well, whatever. We know very well that from the intro he will be okay, so... Yeah. Connor accepted an initiation to fix up Cubic so that he could stay with his group of friends at their workshop. I wonder if he gets to stay. I'm just dying to know. And then, ah! The frag was that? Uh, the, the creepy... Abomination of a base belonging to Dr. K. He seems to be working for some alien thing to find a substance known as Solax. It seems to be some kind of energy that makes spots seem a bit nuts, as we have so witnessed. We has help from none other than Megatron? Wow, really? Neat! They want Solax because... Something to do with power and the possibility of taking over the world, I guess. Of course! Duh. By the way, don't ask me why Dr. K sounds like Team Rocket's Meowth. Who else would it be? Yeah, that's right! However, it somehow just makes him cool. <laughs> Moving on, and it seems that Connor's 24 hours is up. Looks like Cubix isn't gonna wake up. Oh, well? Well, Cubix, so long. You would have made a great friend. Friend. Wait, friend. what's going on? Friend. 
Don't tell me that was the magic word in waking him up. But wait, what's this? Oh no, who will save the bot from the crazy old man? Can no one stand up to him and save the day? Really? Just... really? Was Pikachu Tears not good enough for you? So yeah, he can awesomely transform. <laughs> that is pretty cool. And they rush in and take on Megatron and Dr. K. However, Dr. K got away with the power of bubbles! So Connor and Cubic saves the bot. Connor got to stay in the club and all is happy. To sum it all up, this was okay. The animation was decent for its time, the character development is kinda what do you expect for what it is. Not to say it's bad, but they are pretty standard which could make some of the characters a tad annoying, though some can be really likeable. The world they live in is amazing. Just look at the colours, the designs, mostly robot designs, the humans could be a little hit and miss. But whatever, they make this world look freaking awesome and just so big and oh, you just wish you were there. I kind of want to know about this world. I want to know more about what Solax is and what the heck that is. It could be a little lame, but if you happen to be in a robot loving mood and want to explore a brand new world, then why not give this a watch? There is a little chance that you won't get too overly annoyed. This has been Jetstream, and remember, by controlling the web, I control the world. End transmission.